If you're just joining, we're making cookies and cream or Oreo overnight oats. So I do overnight oats as a snack. You can totally do it for breakfast if you want. I like to have a higher protein breakfast because I have found, and this is just me, maybe you are a breakfast eater and you're not feeling full. It might be because you don't have enough protein. So I like to have a high protein breakfast and then I'll... I hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend. My name is Megan. I'm coming to you guys live from O'Fallon, Missouri, which is right outside of St. Louis. Uh, and I'm super excited to come on here in my kitchen. The link in my bio has changed. So it's that same website, but with Megan, the Megan George at the end. So anyways, hello, happy Sunday. I hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend. I am coming to you guys live from my kitchen to make something with y'all. So as you guys are hopping on, do me a favor, drop me a one down below in the comments. Tell me where you're coming in from. Say, hey, say hi, don't be a stranger. If you guys are watching this live, the little red light will be up here. If you guys are watching this at some point in the future and there's no little red light, go ahead and drop me a two down below in the comments. Tell me where you're coming in from because you matter too. And I want to make sure to thank you guys for watching. We just got back from my brother's house. I got to see my nephews and my niece, uh, and they got to see Maverick, which was exciting uh, for them and exciting for us. Um, we got to see my parents and everything, um, so that was nice. It's nice to have the extra family time. If you guys are doing something fun this weekend, tell me what you're doing down below in the comments. Um, I'm going to make a quick overnight oat recipe. If you guys are subscribed to my emails, uh, if you're not subscribed, you want to go to megalazyketo.com. If you are subscribed, you've already seen this recipe. You had access to it early. If you are one of my customers, please know. If you were one of my customers, you drink ketones with me. There's a new VIP group. I worked so hard today. So hard, but I say that in like the funnest way possible because I don't think anything of what I do is hard. Uh, like you have to choose your hard. I remember Tommy and I were just talking about Memorial Day weekend and I used to work in retail retail on Memorial Day weekend when I worked at Under Armour and all of the shirts that we folded at Under Armour had a piece of paper in it and there would be paper all over the floor. That was hard work. What I do now makes my heart and soul so happy. I was I made a content planner for the new VIP group. So if you're one of my customers, again, drop VIP down below in the comments. We have a new group that's in Facebook. There's tons of recipes in there. We're going to start sharing uh, our favorites with each other. There's like an introduction post where you can put where you're from. And the people who comment on that post are going to get entered into our giveaway. We're going to do more giveaways in there with the VIPs. We're going to have a lot of fun in there. I was working on, I made a content planner and I've been working on getting all of the content that I want planned to go in there. There's recipes already in there and a recipe album. So if you're not in and you're one of my customers, you need to text me and get into that group, 314-697-2269, or you guys have the other number. But send me a text and I will get you the link because Facebook is playing tricks on me. They're doing me dirty, okay? I said this the other day. Mark Zuckerberg said on the news that he wanted people to be more social and stop just scrolling on Facebook. But you have to allow us to be more social, Mark, if you want us to be more social and not put us into Facebook jail, okay? So uh, that is open, and I was working on that earlier today. I've got that going on. Uh, if you've subscribed to my emails, you're getting fun stuff with that. So I'm trying my hardest to give you guys all of the value that I can give you. When you become a customer, Lynn, I know you said you're going to buy on June 1st. When you become a customer, which by the way, the website's still 25% off when you buy two or more boxes of ketones, go to megangeorge.shopketo.com. When you become a customer, you get access to my VIP group. That's where I coach you, I support you, and we create, we're creating our own little community, manifesting the best lives that we can in there all together. So my VIPs, my email subscribers, actually my VIPs are my customers, my email subscribers, got this recipe early and now I'm gonna make it with y'all. So if you guys are ready, drop ready down below in the comments. I'm gonna take a drink. I was gonna try to go live before I went to my brother's house and that just didn't happen today. Uh, Maverick wanted to nap and I normally put him in his bassinet but it was a shorter time frame today and I was like, he was making these weird noises and I'm like, I'm just gonna hold him. So. I just held him for his nap before he went to my brother's house, and so we're going to make this. I got to make my menu chalkboard. I'm going to take a shower and go to bed at a decent time tonight. So, 
Yes. You'll, as soon as you guys purchase ketones, you're invited to the VIP group from this point forward. If you purchased before, you were invited to the VIP Telegram chat. That's what we've been using. But I really want to start using Facebook more. You guys are already on Facebook. That's how you see me anyways. I think in general, people get on Facebook more than Telegram. And so this will be able, I'll be able to like help you guys more because you're already on Facebook. If that makes sense, drop a three down below. That was some of the feedback I got from my current VIP customers was that they would rather have a group in Facebook. So I listen to my customers and want to give them more of what they want. So that's why we're switching it. So the VIP Telegram channel will close eventually, but right now we're working on getting everybody over. So overnight oats. The first thing we need is one half cup of quick or old fashioned rolled oats. I always get asked, why don't I use like just the Quaker oats? Listen, y'all, this is Costco. We go big over here. I get as much groceries as I possibly can from Costco. I order from Costco every single week because I always get their my fruit from there. Um, so like I get mangoes and strawberries and bananas like every single week. Uh, so anything else that I can get from there that I know is going to keep for long and like I can use it in a, a bulker, like get more for your money type style, that's what I'm going to do. And this is the Costco rolled oats. It's um, farmers we know is the or sprouted rolled oats. This is what it looks like, okay? We just like to keep it simple over here. And your girl likes to save money. So, half cup of rolled oats is in the bowl. Then, we're going to do one third cup of your milk of choice, okay? So you can use, uh, I always laugh when I say this, a nut milk. I'm going to use coconut milk because coconut milk uh, is good and helps uh, with lactation. So that's why I've been on a coconut milk kick. But we're going to do one third cup of your milk of choice. We're going to do one tablespoon of chia seeds. Y'all know I love chia seeds. For those of you that you're not familiar with chia seeds, it's a really good source of healthy fat. It does give kind of like a tapioca texture. If you're not a fan of that texture, one thing that you can do is grind up your chia seeds in a blender, then put it into whatever recipe you'll do. This will help your you feel fuller longer with the overnight oats that you do. And for me, any other nursing mamas on here, it will help with lactation as well. As well. So one tablespoon of that. If you're just now joining, uh, drop me a one down below in the comments. Tell me where you're coming in from. Say, hey, say hi. Don't be a stranger. Tell me how your weekend's been going. If you are one of my customers, you need to text me at 314-697-2269 or the other number that I never give on live. That's my personal number that my customers have. I have a brand new Facebook group for y'all that I've been dropping recipes in and tons of value is coming your way. I was just talking about how I scheduled a ton of stuff in there and I'm creating a ton of content for you guys and it's just for my VIP group. Like y'all are even going to see some pictures of Maverick that I'm not posting on social media. So if you guys want access to that, make sure that you guys text me so I can get you added into that. Hi Cindy. Hi Marcia. Hi Melissa. Hi Deb. Hello, Karma and Jennifer, Michelle, Lisa, Stacy, Becky. Hi, Jennifer. Thanks for all the hearts, by the way. That's helping me get out of Facebook jail. So I really, really, really appreciate that. Uh, does your necklace say Maverick? Yes, it says Maverick. This is uh, my push present from Tommy, even though I didn't push. I just surgically removed Maverick. Uh, my number is 314 697 2269. If you're just joining, we're making. Uh, cookies and cream or Oreo overnight oats. So I do overnight oats as a snack. You can totally do it for breakfast if you want. I like to have a higher protein breakfast because I have found, and this is just me, maybe you are a breakfast eater and you're not feeling full. It might be because you don't have enough protein. So I like to have a high protein breakfast and then I'll do my overnight oats as a snack because oatmeal is, again, another power lactation food. So that's why I still do overnight oats. So we have the oats in, the chia seeds, and the milk. Now we're going to do, let me pull up my recipe. 
I also, y'all, some of y'all are missing like the best stuff. I launched a trial today. It's available at megalazyketo.company.site. It's got the can koozie in there that tons of y'all have been asking me about, like the uh, thermos koozie. Y'all have one of those in there. You've got brand new flavors. You get to pick two flavors of keto up, two flavors of keto kick. And then you also get this really cute like travel pouch for your ketones. I only have nine left. And so uh, you might want to go into the VIP chat if you are not, if you haven't looked in there. The link is in the VIP chat. So we need one teaspoon of vanilla extract. I'm not going to measure this. I'm just going to do one little splash. Boom. I like to put stuff away as I go. So y'all are with me for the long haul. It's not really long, but you know. And then we're going to do two teaspoons of uh, maple syrup or your sweetener of choice. I'm just going to use a sugar-free one. Again, I'm not measuring, just eyeballing. As you guys are hopping on, drop me a one down below in the comments. Tell me where you're coming in from. Aw, oh, thanks, Christy. Make sure you guys smash the share button, share this out to a page, to a friend, to a group. Drop the word share down below in the comments once you do for your chance to be entered in to win our prize pack giveaway for the week. Yes, there's Cole's cash on my fridge. We went there yesterday. Tommy got some golf polos, and then we got Maverick a Simba stuffy. So I'm trying to make us a Disney family. I'm trying my heart out. If y'all have been to Disney World with your kids, tell me down below in the comments how many times have you gone? Because I want to take Maverick so many times. I obviously want to wait till he's older and like can't remember it. Well, not obviously. There, that you don't have to wait. You could totally go experience it with them for you because. I will tell you the best was when uh, we just went with my nieces and nephew in December around Christmas time. Wesley was only two. He turned three right after. His little face when it lit up, seeing Mickey and all of like Donald Duck and all the characters at breakfast, it was pure joy. Like, if your soul wasn't, like, lit up and just hugging itself on the inside when you see a kid do that, oh, it's the best. It's the best. The last thing we need is one-fourth cup of, you can use Greek yogurt, whatever kind of yogurt that you want. I am obsessed with this yogurt. If you're someone who's doing high protein like me and focused on the protein, uh, my dietitian friend that a lot of y'all know and you watch um, she's who helped me with gluten-free and dairy-free before IVF to decrease inflammation to help the embryo stick. And we have Maverick. Um, and now she's really helping me just focus on like what I need to be feeding my body so that Maverick can have the best diet and that I can have the best diet and like make milk. Um, and so I'm doing high protein for that reason, but it's helped me burn fat too. So I've, I'm down 34 pounds, three months postpartum because of high protein, a high protein way of eating and ketones. So if you want more information on ketones, all you have to do is message me. We do have a sale right now, 25% off the whole website. Um, we just need one fourth cup of this yogurt. It's the Oikos triple zero protein yogurt. So this um, is what she said is one of like her favorite option basically for yogurt. So we're just gonna stir this up and then we're gonna add some Oreos because Oreos, y'all, I don't know who needs to hear this, but one of the things that I've learned from constantly, constantly being on some sort of diet pretty much my whole adult life, if y'all can relate to that, drop me a heart down below in the comments. This is the first time that I'm really focused on like foods and making sure that I'm not cutting out any sort of whole food group I am just living my life and making healthier choices, okay? Like, I had seconds tonight at dinner, but it was like mostly meat other than anything else. 
uh, because I was still hungry and I wanted to like actually have seconds of something that was going to help me fill up. So I've been so focused on actually like living my life and eating like normal foods, but in moderation. So I'm adding the Oreo thins. It's something that I have now in my pantry. And I'm just looking at like the macros of stuff, but not tracking macros. I'm looking at food labels so that I can learn what's good for me and what I need to like maybe stay away from and not eat so often and maybe have in moderation. I'm learning that like food is not the enemy. Um, it's also not the problem solver. So if you're looking um, to food to like solve your issues, like for me, I turned to food whenever I, I miscarried before and was having problems with my fertility. It's not going to help you with that either. So it's learning to cope with your emotions in a healthy way, and that's not with food. So we're just going to crumble up. These are the Oreo Thins. I'm going to use four of them. Mix those in. And this will be like dessert oats. I'm so excited. And there we have it. Let me be an adult and not just brush my hands off on my pants and let me wash them. And then we just pop the lid on and we let it set overnight. And then this is something that I'll get to enjoy tomorrow. So if you missed it, definitely subscribe to my website, MegalazyKeto.com. I know that's still the name on there. I'm looking to change it to TheMeganGeorge.com so that I'll probably change shortly. But for now, that's what we have. Mav, you want to come say hi to everybody or are you too cranky? Mommy, baby. <gasps> hi. Uh, you want to come say hi? You want to come steal the show? Do you want in there? Hi. Uh, you guys can say hi to Tommy, too. <laughs> but here he is in his muscle tank for the day. You want to show him your muscles? Say, oh, yeah, I got the guns. <laughs> Mommy has way too much fun dressing him. <laughs> way too much fun, don't I, Bubba? So we put on the first outfit today, and it was not the outfit of choice. It was way too tight. He was crying. His pants were too tight. That was supposed to be his 4th of July outfit, and uh, that didn't happen. So, you watching Daddy? He's not teething quite yet. No, we're not there yet. It does it does seem like it's probably coming just around the corner, but we're not there yet. Your foot, it was dragging. You're too tall, Bubby. So... There we have it. That's our overnight Oreo oats. And that's all we got, right? Now we gotta make mommy's menu chalkboard and then take a shower and then it's time for bed. Yeah, you're already getting hungry so mommy doesn't have a lot of time. So I love y'all. We appreciate you guys so, so much. Uh, we hope you guys have a great night. If you want to subscribe to my website, that's what I was saying. Go to MegalisaKeto.com. You can subscribe for the weekly emails that I do. Posting tons of new recipes on there. We're having more, even more uh, happen this week. And again, if you guys are one of my customers, you already purchased ketones, make sure you text me. I want to make sure to get you guys in this group where I'm giving you tons of value. I'm pouring my... Listen, this is the year where I'm using my time wisely. And what I mean by that is is I am really, really focused on pouring more and more and more into those that have joined me. Uh, that If you're trusting me on your journey, I want to give you everything I got. So I listened. I heard your guys' feedback. That's why I'm doing the group on Facebook. I'm putting tons of value in there, pouring my heart and soul into that. I want to make sure you guys get in there. We're going to be starting to do giveaways very soon. 
And then um, I'm also pouring my heart and soul into a lot of team stuff. Uh, we go to Kentucky this week, actually, for Maverick's first event. So that's that'll be exciting. So make sure you guys follow us for that. Um, and, yeah, website's 25% off. And if you guys have questions, just let me know. Love y'all. I appreciate you guys, and we'll see you guys later. Bye.